Hey folks, welcome back to Forever Skies. We just had a rainstorm and I was just noticing the metal looks wet afterward. Good job game. <laughs> Hasn't dried out yet. Anyway, oh, I wanted to show you my, my excellent landing job here. I did some work on the ship but I needed supplies so I moved uh, all through these last two smaller uh, lower platforms to gather supplies on the way out to these greenhouses and another question mark so I'll try and play with all those today but I couldn't get into actually there's one below us isn't there think about that yeah there's another structure down there and it's one that doesn't have a door look at that swarm of moths uh, so you've got to take out the side of the wall in order to do it I didn't have my my uh, handheld extractor on so I had to fly around and rip the place apart and land again anyway last time we had put this back in and I like the design I didn't like that I had to walk the whole length of the ship in order to get to the fabricator so off camera I swapped everything out move the fabrication area up front or closer to the front in the middle of the ship I guess you'd say along with the extras you know, like the virus scanner and all that kind of goes along with all of that kitchen is still over here this could maybe be bedroom or something but that puts this on both sides of the back I'm not sure what to do with these three spaces yet but it looks pretty good I think nice big open area back here and the heart of the ship and all the workings up here I got rid of all of the indoor stuff on the outside and put outdoor stuff on the outside so I feel a lot more confident walking around here now but I'm still spooked every time I walk into there I kind of like put my hand over my eyes is is it real or am I gonna ah, fall through hmm anyway um let's grab something to eat Send you down, send you down. And I did... Say, did I grab it already? No. Pulled a sun melon out of there, so I've got a new lure. And let's see. This is the new fabrication area. I figure there'll be a wall cabinets in there when we find them, which we need to be looking for soon. But maybe they'll be at the question mark coming up. We'll see. Um, what am I doing here? Put that away. These I need to move still. But still got this kind of stuff in it the glass is there let's grab both of these boom boom and still have lures on them good they haven't run out yet all right toss you in and boil toss you in and boil grab a water out of there uh let's see if there's yeah let's make use of this this rainwater while it's available I think that's most of the uh, the housekeeping done. There we go. So with that, I could use some sleep. Otherwise, I'd say let's take off immediately and hit that greenhouse right there. And then a low platform, and then out there to the question mark. And we have another uh, under the dust platform there. There's actually many of them. There's one there. I don't know if we came from that one and went around the mountains and did things here then came back or or what but when it originally gave us that uh, that order to go find the place with the exclamation point to go under the dust if you remember there were four or five of them available so there's lots of places to go under the dust all right so let's toss the biggest one well the longest one longest lasting is right there okay Toss, so nowhere to toss you. Let's go out over here. Toss you into there. And let's grab some sleep. Go ahead and max this out. Then eat that moth and drink some water and get on our way. Yeah, she's all excited now. <laughs> oh boy, you're gonna die. <laughs> nope, stop that. Okay, so early morning light hitting us. Grab you and a couple of you, and we are good. If it was another game, I would hit the quick save right now. Something like, like Skyrim, when everything is 
is in great shape and is exactly where you want to be in case you ever have to start over and well, that's where we are right now but I want to go out there there you are okay we're not gonna hit him got the battery right yeah I think the flashers are gone okay it's up in the air don't you hit me that's right we have batteries now let's make use of them let's pop you in turn you on Pop you in and turn you on. Just for fun. Okay. So I'll have my sentries uh, guard our pathway. Shoot everything that's going to plow into us. Yeah, there you go. Take them out. Don't cross the beams. Another one. There you are. It's kind of fun. <laughs> okay, let's get some altitude. Now, which one of these ramps have the least number of stairs to climb? A lot of different designs on these greenhouses and some of them are annoying. That looks like a big staircase on this side. What does that look like over there? Meanwhile, uh, you guys can take all the, the glass out that you want. Thank you very much. Okay, let's stop there. I'm gonna walk out and take a look and wow, this is laggy up here. Okay, so big ramp that goes up to a staircase over there and ramp and stairs over there so I guess we have a ramp no matter what that looks I don't know about the same but let's let these uh, let these guys do their thing In fact, can I go any higher I can I want glass guys I want lots and lots of glass so just let you do your thing for a while perfect uh, can I get closer? Let me you happier. Right there. But you are intent on hitting down below first. All the metal. Come on, guys, go for glass. Yeah, I can't choose without until we get the uh, the next updated version of these guys. And I could set all four of them to glass if I wanted to, and they would just sit here and clean this out. You know, there's not a lot of glass up in there. Like, maybe we've been here before. Oh, there's some glass, but this whole side's pretty much empty. I wonder if this is the very first greenhouse that we went to. We only cleaned out one side. And what do you want to bet this is going to uh, thunderstorm on us? Okay, let's drop down. And... Can't quite see what's under us, but... Let's go over to this one. And as far as dropping down quickly for a thunderstorm, let's see what's under us when we land here. We do have you underneath. Okay. But if we were to... Hmm. Maybe from this angle. If we had to drop... Just back up a little and go down, I think we'd make it. Okay. That sounds like a plan. Drop into here. A little bit further. Don't remember what the number is here. In fact, this one's a little off. Oh, yeah. That ship rock. Boom. Um, we landed. Yeah, it really exaggerates things. Okay, so what have I got on me? What do I need? Food is good for a while. It wouldn't hurt to have the... Boy, where have I got that? Here? Yeah, the crossbow. And... I actually don't need you for a while, so we'll just leave you there. And let's grab a stack of five. Got two different kinds of batteries. Don't need the lure. Toss you in here. And... Two empty bottles. I never did find the... Or did we just not research the big bottle? Let me think here. Big bottle... Is that water? It is. Large bottle needs polymers and synthetics. Let's do that. Um, I'm over here now. So, synthetics, grab a stack. Polymers is probably here. Yeah. Stack of you. And... Extra bottles. There's two of them. Okay. Let's do that twice. Water. Bottle. Bottle. So we'll collect plant oil in a large bottle this time. Which means, well, plant oil in one and dirty water in another. So 
probably get rid of another one of these. Yeah, I think so. Synthetics can go away. And I'd say that's fine. Yep, you're there, you're there. And we'll grab 20 dirty water and as much plant oil as we can find. Unless we've been here before and already stripped this place. We may have landed on the lower one, would be my guess. If it was the first if this was the first greenhouse. Uh that looks pretty stripped out over there. Alright, go to twenty. Um there we are. Nineteen. Twenty. <laughs> okay, what have we got? Oh, we've got some stuff in here. Yep, I guess this place is new. Data card. Uh, more paint patterns. Okay. I did get a couple of data cards at those other places I went to, but they were all uh, light fixtures. Bent light fixtures. So the light fixtures seem to be kind of like a... Oh, like a rope light on the wall. It's not very effective. Pretty um, constrained to just the immediate area that you place it in. So, not like a, an overall room lighting. So, I played with it a little bit on my, my other save and wasn't all that impressed with it. So, hopefully they come out with some, some nice room lights. Maybe colored room lights would be kind of fun. Um... Here we go. Polymers. Can always use those. More in this room first. More polymers. What's that? Where'd that go? On this side? There you are. Okay. So we're done there. Uh, what do I keep seeing? The glass. Okay. Oh, I should have got the, uh, the hand extractor. Yeah. You. That's it there. Okay, up above. Any fuels? Don't see any. And one last glance through there. I think we're pretty good there. Okay. Um, that will pass on the hand extractor. I think we'll be okay. In here, more of you. Wow, lots of plant oil at this one. I remember right, that very first greenhouse, I was surprised at how little plant oil it had compared to what I had seen online from other playthroughs. It was pretty empty. Okay, uh, am I seeing the... I guess not. I thought I was seeing the knife pop up on the side, but it's not. Okay, what I miss? Nope, I guess we're good. And... Don't fall in. Okay, I could use another data pad. I guess because I asked for it, it said, uh-uh, storm is coming. Well, we'll see what that means for us. Boy, that sounds ominous. Yeah, let's go higher, huh? That's probably not smart. Let's get inside the greenhouse. Uh, four. And reload. Okay. I think we'll be safe inside here. And then some little critter's going to jump out and scream at us, right? Yeah, no, we're safe in here. Okay. Well, I'm glad that we got a good night's sleep. Be a lot of stamina issues here real soon. Okay, five is all that I can handle at a time. I can keep it from going red down there in the stamina bar. And he doesn't get all winded. But I kind of like the biofuel. Wow. You? Nope. So I will take the biofuel whenever I can. I think it's a, it's a nice process to create. It gives you something to do that's more than just 
throwing in some synthetics, calling it gasoline. I don't know how that quite works out, but oh well. This feels like you're actually doing something. Oh, I'm getting tired. Here's where an endurance uh, booster would be good. Okay, so we seem to be good in here. Now, the patats... No, the ink flowers and something else were used in ink production. Ooh, these are good. I don't know if we've done this yet on this series. The coffee beans. Let's see if it's possible to scan one of you. Nope. So a coffee nut, maybe because I already grabbed one. Hydration level's decreasing. Um, so it gives you a... Beck, I could eat one right now and get a boost, although my energy's up there pretty good. Um, drink you and drink you to clear up a space. Okay. So we'll take you three. Unfortunately, they don't stack well, so they're going to take up space in here. Um, otherwise, we're outside in a lightning storm. Yeah, it just doesn't seem wise. Holding a metal knife. What do you have to say? Water shortages. The water filter in the garden has been damaged. It will take weeks, if not months, to fix. We recommend f relying on your own water supplies. Replenish it with pre-filtered rainwater only as a last resort. If you can, boil it. We will try to buy water from other sectors, but we cannot promise anything. So, messages from a time long ago when there were still people inhabiting all of these places. So, lots of rain. Does that mean the storm, the lightning is done? Or does that mean I've got a little bit of a... Yeah, of a reprieve. There we go. I'll collect you. And any more of you? No. How about over in here? No, there's more coffee nuts all the way up through there. And... Oh, the storm's back. It wasn't quite finished. And that is a problem. That will slice you up trying to get in there. So we'll have to come back with a hand extractor. There's nothing in here. And same thing there. I can't get in. Okay. So space. I have a little bit of space left. Let's get inside the building for the rest of the lightning storm. Okay. So let's grab... Three of these will make a the highest quality lure. I think I can pull that off. So let's grab one round of that. Three. No lightning so far, so maybe it is done. I could use something to eat. I don't have a dinner on me. Nope. And that's three. Okay. And... A gnome! Looky there. Um, nothing that I want to leave behind, so we will come right back to this. Alright, let's get down this place before we get electrocuted. No helium. Am I crawling? I am. Alright, so where do we park? Not that one. Ah, there's an airship. Don't you love the stairs with the holes in them? Whoops! <laughs> okay. Did we take any damage? Let's... I don't have an empty. Yeah, I'm gonna have to... Well, I can toss some in here, right? Yeah. So you can go in there. And... Let's see, for that matter... E. You can go in there. And then the rest of you. And cook you up. Oh, you dinner. Get the rest of that so I can drop you in there. Okay. So, I pretty much need one more. A clean big bottle. A dirty big bottle. And a specialty big bottle. And, oh! I actually filled all 20 in there. Wow, didn't expect that. Now, is there a space over here for that? You're pretty much overloaded, aren't you? 
Yeah, polymer's got to go back in there too, and all of this. So we need we need to figure out the storage situation. Now, seems like it was a greenhouse that had the oh something broken down on the side of one of these platforms. I think that was the upgrade station. So that's probably not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the station that builds furniture. I can't think of the name of it off the top of my head, but there is that one to find soon, and I don't know exactly where to find it. But for now, let's grab some dinner. And you are 50 and 30. Okay, that sounds perfect. Maxed us out almost all the way through. Now, three of canola makes this guy and biomass and polymer wow that's a lot of polymer boy that's expensive I mean this right here is pretty cheap by comparison and it does almost as good a job it goes six times and 10 to 20 seconds whereas this does it 10 times and 5 to 15 seconds it only gets the best but I kind of like the dust lettuce I do so we'll do one of you so I don't necessarily have to go back and get all the rest of that canola. And this, unless there is something else that the canola was good for. Um, none of those. Just looking down there to see if canola is involved with any of this. What was that other one? Oh, it's so the plant resin makes epoxy. Okay, whoops. You are biomass. Now... Got you and you, otherwise everything else is regular. Well, that's bruise flower and lobster chili. So you, no plants in there. Now, all of you guys. So, upgrade station, automatic deck extractor. So we've got all these, but there's another station. So, kind of keep my eyes open for that. But right now I'm looking for anything organic, and there's nothing organic in there. Now, the paint. Where did you go? Are you not here? You're over here. Alright, so at this end, filtering bottle takes a colander. I don't think we really need the filtering bottle. Unless we want to use it to drink on the go. That's possible. Anyway, you... Right there. Ink bulb and bruise flower. Petite Ostre. I don't think I've come across that one before. That's not the patat. Or the potatoes. Ink bulb. Ink bulb and bruise flower. Ink bulb and dust daisy. Okay. So you need a lot of these things to paint. It's ten of them per panel. So I don't know, I'm not all that thrilled about the, the whole paint thing personally, but... But uh, it is something to do. So let's boil you and boil you. Take one of you with us. Otherwise, let's remind me what the bottles were. Water, large bottle. So we have enough polymer already. We need another empty bottle and we need 30 synthetics. Okay, empty bottle right there, 30 synthetics. Have a small stack anywhere? We do not. Okay, let's get another big bottle. And another big bottle. I think they're pretty quick. Eh, not quick enough. Let's put the synthetics away. There's a lure. But I don't think there's room for another lure. No. Yeah, I'll toss you in there. And grab both of you. So we will put right there. You and you and one more bottle for something else. Okay. So you can drop into there. And a miscellaneous box just to grab a few more of these guys. And we're ready to, to head back out. You guys, coffee nuts. It's going to give us a burst of energy and we don't need it right now. So I'm just going to leave those in there. Okay, back in. How are you doing? You've got one empty tank. 
you've got one empty tank and nothing you can reach from here. Okay. Almost forgot the hand extractor. Yeah, well, actually I did forget. I got all the way up there and came all the way back. Now I'm going all the way back up there. All right. Did we miss anything in here? Any ladders at this level? No, I have to go up above and then drop back in. I was looking to see if there's any more of the coffee bean or whatever it is that those are called. It was a name similar to that. Whoa. So, let's go up a level. See if we can figure it out. Now, we do have the green colanders in here, though now I don't need one. Though I don't remember... Let's grab one anyway. Uh, three. Now, gotta grab it before it falls. E, gotcha. I want to run that through the virus scanner and just make sure there's nothing else that it can do. Okay, so let's get into these guys. Uh... You we've been in. Okay. And this is the way up to other places with the ladder, but looking to see if there's any of the of those coffee beans in here. This is the tree. Okay, do I go up this way? Yeah. So up you, but there's nothing hiding in the branches. Okay. Really? There's nothing there. Uh, oh, there you are. Okay. How do I reach you? I mean, that can't be enough. No. Alright, so how do I get over there? You just kind of run and jump and slice while you're plunging to the your doom? Maybe you jump up. Boy, I don't know. That one's tough. Nothing on there. We've got one lobster chili, but don't have any use for those. Don't remember them being having very much food to them either. Uh, from here, can I get anywhere? Wow. You don't want me to go through. You want me to walk all the way around the outside. Ah, uh, Yeah. And drop into there. Yeah, there he is. Oh, I bet you I could... Can I do this? Nope. Can't do that. Reload? Nope, nothing to reload. So, put you away. And I doubt I can... I swear, you can't recover your... Uh, where am I? Your... Bolts. Ha! <laughs> well, shot right over there. Okay. Well, that didn't happen. Can I do anything from here? I might be able to. First of all, can I recover those? I cannot. Okay. Just like Minecraft, get right to the edge. Now, nope. jump. Gotcha. I get you. I gotcha. Okay. Whew. Mission accomplished. Now, don't walk through glass. Let's head over to this one. Um, hand extractor and shoot this one out. Yeah, there we go. So, four? No, three. Got you. Unfortunately, we don't have the freezer yet, so they're not going to last all that long. Do you have that to? To worry about but it's coffee what are they called actually yeah coffee nuts hard shell protects a bitter nut eating it raw is not advised mm hmm so don't see any more in the bushes in there in the lee oh there's something out over there no that's not okay well, that's it okay otherwise there's biomass in here, and let's go over to this one. Five. 
Listen to that wind up there. Look at the clouds going by. Hmm. Okay, any more critters? Nope, no critters. So much more coffee. So much more than we're going to be able to deal with. Yeah, I won't have to sleep for days. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can catch these. They're on the outside. That's going to be a problem. Huh. Okay. Oh, didn't get it. Nope. So they're down on that platform. They'll be waiting for us. Or they're smashed and worthless. We'll see. Okay, over here. Nope. All right. What do we call this episode? The Great uh, Coffee Nut Caper. Um, I don't see any ink bulb. I really don't. Space-wise, we're doing okay. I'm going to get down on my hands and knees and mow the lawn for a while. I'll see you guys after I build this all up. Alright, well, I think that's enough. Well, we find fuel randomly at other places anyway, so I don't need a, a major supply of it. But let's grab the battery. There we go. Anything else? There tends to be things up above in these greenhouses. Over there, it'd be some lobster chilies and what have you, and kind of give you the challenge of trying to get to a lot of running and jumping. Because I don't know if we, maybe if we got a few more uh, turbines, maybe we can get high enough to land up here. I don't know what the limits are. I know I can't right now, but. I think we're going to call this one good. Let's go down and see if we can find the uh, <laughs> the coffee nuts that fell. And I want to go actually to there. Okay. Let's not run with a knife. <laughs> there we go. Don't think we need any more dirty water. And that is not the way home. Why did that flicker like that? I don't have a tool on. Huh. Don't know. Alright, so down this ladder. And let's see if anything is waiting for us. It might not be. It looks like there's quite a space. Whoa. Between... Oh, there they are. So... Ah. Right off of there. Okay. And we're full. I get one of them? No. Okay. Well, let's run these through. I uh, can't even do that. Well, I can eat one of them. So notice where the stamina is right now, or the energy. Let's go through one. Oh, that pretty much maxed it out. Okay. So what can I get rid of? Let's get rid of some biomass. And I did find one ink bulb and one bruise flower. So, what did it actually take? Can I do anything with one? Um, actually, I can. So, a complex pattern cartridge. And I can even do a metallic pattern cartridge. You don't see, I don't see me doing metallic. So, let's go with the complex. Okay. So, that teaches us how to make it, is all. Alright, pull you up. Put one of you in. Uh boil. Ah, uh, that's what I wanted to do. Can I put you in there? I cannot. Can I put you in there? I cannot. Okay. So there's nothing else I can do virus-wise with those. I want to test all the organics that you can find. Uh, dehydration. Okay, we're about to die apparently. There we go. And sure, let's do another round. Boy, these big bottles are nice. Okay, so drop you. Eventually, I can put a 20 in here and never reload it again. Cool. Well, you. So, I need more containers. Let's do one more big box. Ah, uh, the big box is... Oh, synthetics, metals, and, a, and an epoxy. Okay, so let's grab a single epoxy and then a stack of synthetics and metals and make one... Oh, just one. Maybe we'll make two big boxes. 
or not. <laughs> so grab you and toss another one of you in there. Get everybody coiled and add to the, the lifespan a bit. Uh, drink some more water. Two of those ought to do. Uh, don't need any more energy, so don't want to eat that. But I guess I could eat the green colander when it comes out. Okay. Otherwise, where to put that big new box? Just kind of a miscellaneous, really. Uh, green colander. So eat you. Yeah, that gave us a good burst. So yeah, I just need a miscellaneous box till we start. Uh, oh, till we find the wall cabinets, or can build shelves to put smaller boxes on or something. So you, well, let's put. We're done up there. So, not going to be hand extracting or shooting things. We can do that. Okay, leave you there. And I guess that's enough for the moment. Alright, All right. take you out, toss you in, toss you boiled. So you're the not boiled. I didn't reboil the wrong one, did I? I guess I'll find out. Okay. So, I want as much glass as I can get. And the easiest way that I've got to do that is just to climb up in here and let you guys just have a ball. Well, you're very specific on what level you can be at. Let's take this level here. What have you got for me? Right there. That's it? Over a little? Change your angles. There you go. Yeah, these are very specific. Can I go a little higher? Oh, I am at my max. That is it. Boy, I wish I could strafe. Yeah, if I could strafe, I'd just strafe around in a great big circle with the guns pointed in. Alright, so you... Yeah, nothing looks bad, so I guess I didn't get it wrong. You and you. Boil. And toss you in there. And one more of you guys in there. Okay, so that's the end of those foods. And the big box. There you are. Um, at the moment, it's kind of like foods. I think I'll just... Hmm... Drop you right here, I guess. Four. Okay. So, like that for now. And let's get back to this. So, pull back. We'll just head out this way, go to the other side of it. What they want so badly to shoot up and down there. <laughs> okay. Swing around. Far enough? Nope, not far enough. Let's go further there. I can't go up any higher. Maybe you guys... Whoa, 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 whoa. There. Can you hit anything? There you go. You only got one. Two. Okay. Right there. Anything? Really? You guys are a little worthless, you know that? I can do better than that. Alright, what's in here? At least I can until the deck, ah, rocking deck starts to mess up my aim. Let's grab you. I like window walls, so I have to do the work to get the glass. A storm is coming. Yeah, great. And look at that sky change. Wow. All right, all right. Directly on behind us. There we go. Pull back and drop. Looking good behind. We're clear up front. And just drop. Okay. Get down low. We'll be fine. <laughs> Looks like Poncho's got his arms up over his head hiding from the thunder. At least that's the way it looks like from here. Okay, down into about that range of elevation. Okay. 
You guys are shooting those. There's lots more supplies. Okay, so a couple of you. What's my time limit on these guys? And that's right. We go through and close all these. It will actually quiet down here in the uh, here inside. Wow! Listen to the difference. Okay, I don't have to feel like I have to yell now. Almost three days on these. Good. Okay, so... Let's grab the glass out of these. There we go. Yeah, that is so much more comfortable. So what are we going to do back in here? So, am I sealed here? We're sealed there. We're sealed there. So it's just the noise is coming out of here now. And out of up here. Yeah. Uh, two? Yeah, give me a glass wall. Can I? I can do that from here. Alright, that's all those. Close these doors. And up in here. And close these doors. Okay, we're sealed now. Except for the back end. So I'm guessing that I'm going to want at least a door in the middle, which needs electronics. And let's grab a stack of everything. So, door in the middle. Uh, yeah. Let's get over there first. <laughs> I'm going to keep walking until I think I'm in the right place. Just to uh, make a guess. Alright, we'll just do that for now. So that officially seals us in for, I think, about the first time this entire series, huh? Yeah. I mean, listen to the difference. Nice. Okay. Um, how long have I been recording? Yeah, I can go for a little bit longer. So, hmm, let's look at the radar. I know we want to get to that, that question mark. All right, oh, three question marks in a row. Now, so I heard, I watched one series. Of course, I can't check it out right now. I'm so low and in a storm. But you see the orange flashing lights out there of a, of a platform or the white flashing lights. And he made the comment that if it's flashing fast, then there's something there that you don't have. You know, there's something there that's important. And uh, something to, to scan. Something new. So, let's spin this around. The, the app. Incoming is from this direction here. Let's give the guns a, something to aim at. There we go. Um, so, if we get up high enough, I, I don't know if the storm's over. Sure, quieted down out there. Let's get up. Might just be rain or might be nighttime. Probably nighttime. So we're kind of going this direction. Somewhere off in there. So a fast flashing light means there's something there that we don't have yet. Okay, there's another one over here. No, they're all off in this direction and we're, we can only see one of them. Oh, there's the other one. So, that rate of flash is about the same as this rate of flash. Okay. So, I'll be curious to see if we go for a while and suddenly we see something that's, you know, doing a full... Right over there. See how fast the blue lights are, fl are flickering? There's something there that we have not gotten yet. Now, that happens to be a question mark, so that makes sense. But, ooh, nice and clear now. Let's go see what that is. Ah, there's the wreck out there on the pedestal. This is, I believe, the piece that we need to make furniture. I think that's it. So let's drop down into there and just drop our nose right onto that platform. I think we've seen one of these early on and 
somehow missed getting over here and scanning this. Unknown location. Okay, coming in a little slower. Yeah, that's the workstation right there. Alright, that looks pretty close. I like it. Drop down a touch more. Boom, we're in. Uh, door. Door in the face. All right, what are you called? You are the ship, wrecked ship workstation. So I guess a ship workstation. Okay. So, in other words, things that go onto the ship as compared to what goes, I don't know, onto your person. So, furniture, lighting, that sort of thing. Okay. Preliminary analysis and now that we've already found it. Okay, new objects. Is there something besides this? Nope. We just found it. Okay. So that is the There we go. I'm trying to see the words in there. Something station. So it's it's that one. Okay, so we found this. And let's go back over to the regular platform and clean this place off. And we'll call this episode done. So up in the air a little over. Pull back. And guys, can you... Actually, maybe you can't hit, hit copper right now. Maybe you don't have an empty uh, bay. Where did that moth ever end up? Right there. And you haven't haven't spoiled yet so let's eat you and drink some more water and pull some more water out of there there's no more dirty water to put in okay um, I don't like this closed off area it feels a little claustrophobic so let's open this place up and what I wanted to know was do we have an empty bay for for copper so let's pull uh, like so. That gives three possibilities in case it immediately grabs another synthetic and another metal and fills it up. So with that, we should be able to... Let's see, the other way. Hit some copper on the way in, right? By going slow, there's a bunch of copper right there in front of us. Can you not get the angle? No, you can't. You're just hitting floaters. Okay. So, not as impressed as I hoped I would be with our automatic turrets. Automatic uh, extractors. Alright, so drop you in there. Try to time it with the, with the uh, up and down of the ship. Space-wise, let's empty these out. So at the very least, they're going to keep us full of synthetics and metals. I'd hope for better, but I'll take what I can take. Alright, so some biomass over there. You might well be full. You are. Okay, let's go see what we can find. Don't shoot me. <laughs> One would think that that would hurt. <laughs> Now, I don't have the hand extractor with me, do I? What am I holding? That is a one. Okay, that's a scanner. Okay. So the hand extractor would have been nice. Anything in here? Besides copper. No, just copper. Alright, so what does this platform have to offer? There's some helium. Which we will need when we find our freezer. Hopefully it's the freezer. I have, I'm assuming that that will make food last longer than the refrigerator. Okay, so you're there. 
Nothing else up here. I can safely drop onto that one. A couple more of you. And you're going to take a battery, aren't you? Yep, your battery room. And you and you. And we did discover that one time that not all of these are guaranteed to give you a battery's worth of goods. Though this one looks very promising. One, two, three. Not as promising, though. Four, five, six. Just six of them. Okay. Yeah, this is actually kind of a kind of a dud. Interesting. Ah, seven? Or oh, I missed one of those six. One or the other. Okay, so somehow I got you turned on. Let's turn you back off. Anything around the corner? No. Okay. Can you imagine actually living up here in one of these structures? For real. Ah, and that's how you had to get home each day. <laughs> wow. Okay, door. Oh, extra room. This is the uh, the kids' room where they stored the their toy machine parts. Data card. Solid wall shelf. Ooh. Okay. I'm liking that. Maybe the refrigerator's on the floor, a solid wall shelf above, and the cooker's sitting on top, or something like that. Alright, I hate jumping out of this room. Ah, Okay, been there? Been there. Have not been that direction. Eee! Because there's nothing in that direction. Okay. So, this doesn't look like there's an under deck with more helium. No, I think we've seen it all already. Okay, let's see if we can get out of here. Nothing else missed. Ah, look at you. Okay, up. Battery. The storm about to hit. Actually, one last look over here. Didn't miss anything there. I wish I could take the little stool or folding table. I like that. Otherwise, we have a bunch of coppers hiding out there. So, really, the price for this place was that right there. Not an overabundance of helium or anything like that. Okay. So there's copper hiding in all of these towers. I think I'll try to take them out myself. Our, our, uh, our sentries here, don't you shoot me, are kind of worthless in regard to copper. Alright, so take you up. And... Uh, let's see, release, and let's just do these by hand. That's you guys, any epoxy, or a synthetic bottles, oh, missed one. Okay, those are good. I like the deck gun on both sides. I think that is a great design. Okay, you guys are both right there. You are, oh, you're not too far away. Oh, I'm sure you are. Okay, so two orange flashing lights and they're flashing slow. Okay. And no bottles out there to take out. So let's see if it's possible to maneuver into a place where we can sneak a shot in that angle right in there. Wish it wasn't raining and I had a clear shot at it or a view of it. I don't know which direction I need to go to get to it. And that one was really a tough one. I bet you that one is from the top, from the outside corner only. Let's try that. Let's swing around. We've got to get above that blade. Let's see, that's this one. A little higher. Yeah, I'm thinking that you are... It looks like a basketball backboard right there. <laughs> I'm thinking you are right about there. 
No, you're blocked from this angle too. Okay. Well, we're going to have to give up on you guys. Don't see any others. But, yeah, great big basketball backboard. Uh-huh. I'm sure that's what it was. Yeah. All right, a couple of little platforms over there. Otherwise, the other question marks were right on out that way. I don't see any lights over there, but the lights may not have uh, uh, spawned into the game yet. But I'm thinking there's something there, and either over there or over there. Okay. So, I think that is probably... Well, I'm going to edit out a few minutes of this thing. Let's let's head over and see what we find. At the very least, we'll, we'll scope it out for next time. Okay. I do have room left, but I have no batteries left. These guys are these guys are empty. Okay. What was that? Fuel is depleted in one engine. Okay, we're doing the uh, the head bob thing as we're flying. <laughs> it's probably time to upgrade those engines so we can get two uh, uh, fuel bays or you know storage in each one. Then you, I think the. The tactic is to put a really good fuel in one of them, and a, the second, the the other slot can be whatever you find, synthetics or, or what have you. That way, it'll use up the little stuff, then default to the uh, to the good stuff. But we'll just take our time and meander over here. Okay, we're close enough that there would be a light, and there is not, but it is a valid question mark. So, this is just a different kind of structure than we're used to. Interesting. And I see the the building down below, kind of like the command center was built. Oh, there's a flash. Where'd that flash come from? There was one flash, then it went away. Oh, another one? I don't know. Am I seeing things? I guess I'll find out when we get there. Unless there is a tower and we are perfectly in line with it so that there's something in the pathway. Let me swing to the side a little bit. Nope. But it is a new location. I'm thinking it's the command center. Which means either the freezer or the refrigerator. Down on the very bottom floor of that thing. Fun to get to. Yeah, I think that's what it is. We'll land on it, and we'll uh, probably hit this next episode. Let's go ahead and drop altitude. Okay. Fuel depleted in one engine. Yeah, because I started up again. All right, let's stop there. Rotate around. Pull back. About like that. Drop down in, keep, and we're in. Locked? Not locked. Just landed. Yeah, we're going to keep banging, aren't we? Well, let's pull forward a little bit and see if we can officially land on this thing. There we are. Landed. Command center. Okay. So what officially is it going to give us? Analysis completed and... Hold down the tab, and we are going for the... That's too bright to see. The freezer! Woohoohoo! All right. So I want to see... I want to know if these guys can sit on top of the freezer and still fit underneath this. I don't think they'll sit on a table. There's not enough room. But the freezer may be a little bit lower than the table. We'll find out. Then we'll move all the stuff around and kind of create the kitchen if we can oh we also need to get this guy going what do we need polymers and glass let's go grab those real quick and make that happen glass is here polymers are hiding over here oh we used up all those polymers from the greenhouse but it's enough okay get you going where does that live it kind of lives right there. Because I want cabinets all through here. Hmm. 
Maybe you move. What's that? Q? And four. You don't fit in there, do you? No. Let's put you... I guess something like that. Alright, so... That's done. What's it take to build you? Tools. We need a motherboard. Motherboard is... Where is that? This one? Motherboard is plastic scrap. Uh, I'm over here. Plastic scrap's that one. Okay, motherboard. And then needed what? Uh, some machine parts and some electric parts. Okay, we can handle that one. That's over there. Already have enough of those, just need a stack of these. Alright, motherboard. Actually, you're about done. Printing Perfect. Printed. And tools. Not enough machine parts. There you are. Alright. Unless research goes somewhere else. I think it does. So if you went, well, for right now, just went right there. I think I want the other one right here. We'll see. See how we can make these guys interact with each other. You're only about halfway done. Okay, I need water. I don't have any cans to get rid of, so we'll just do that twice. Foods and energy. Oh, I know where we can find energy. <laughs> okay, two of you. And... Actually, that, that may be too much. How much energy? 25. We'll wait just a little bit on you. Alright, there you are. And I want you, like, here. So, I'm gonna have to... If I... Hmm. If I... Put you here as tight as I can. What does this boy? That guy's just in the wrong place. He really is. There we go. Four R. Oh, it does fit. Okay, that looks good. Tuck you right there. So all of our fabrication is kind of in this area. And then the supplies that I need to build whatever I need to build. Okay. So this guy does what? Complex... Oh, so all of our paint cartridges come out of here. Really? Yeah, they do. Okay. So paint cartridges... All of the data pads we've been finding, the amber storage rack, the simple wall shelf we just found, the solid table, office desk, solid wall shelf, that's what we just found. Uh, casual table, basic chair, office chair, good stuff. And then all the lighting, the curved and bent lights we've been seeing, but it's like a, a little track light, real thin, just a little thin strip that goes through there, so don't know how effective that is, but we'll play with it a little bit, but they all take epoxy and lots of it. Uh, you... There we go. Epoxy. Epoxy. Actually, not as much as I thought. You take polymer. Yeah. And then these guys take ink bulbs and bruised flowers. There is talk of a future update giving us the ability to grow plants on the ship. So I can see us having a, a, a grow bed up above at some point. Yeah, full of ink bulbs and bruise flowers, apparently. Anyway, I think that... Yeah, that, that's a good conclusion to this, uh, to this episode. Finally got to see that, that done. Alright, so let's call this one done. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.